And here it is, the castle in all its glory. I'm super, super happy with where this build came out. I think the only thing I wish I had done is maybe added another house over here, like over there. But uh, apart from that, I think I'm really, really happy the way this came out. Especially this front section. This was the bit I did at first anyway. And I think it just it just looks really, really cool. <laughs> So, um, okay, we'll start with this front section. So at the front here we've got this guy, this little farmer. We can give him to focus, there we go. There we go. Little farmer. Oh, shit. Oh. With his little shovel. He's just farming some carrots. He's, so we've got some little carrots there, about the, fen about the little fences. Farm. Then as we keep going over here, we've got these knights going out on patrol from the castle. Got a little path, a little cold path. Just like a few kind of ones here and there. So slightly damaged path, but there's still cobbles there. Then we've got this house over here with a little apple tree coming out of it, which I th I still absolutely love. I'm, I'm, I think this is definitely my favourite house in this build, without a doubt. I just think it came out so, so well. Uh, then also at the front we've got this, this little bit on the other side of the moat with some little flowers on it. Got a few guards by the gate, some vines coming out the walls and some little bits of like detail on the wall. I tried to get as much detail as I could to this wall using a few different techniques. And then there's this side of the build, so we've got a little tree. Not my best tree, but I still quite like it. Got this guy who's just chopping some wood at the front. Then we've got the other guy on the other side doing a bit of fishing. Ooh. A bit of fishing. And he's got his little uh, rack with fish on and his little uh, lantern so we can see if he wants to go fishing tonight. Then if we come up here, we've got the wall itself. And then we've got these little braziers, I've got those on each side. And then we've got some knights at the top. We've got uh, this character who's the, the knight from. Uh, from the medieval blacksmith, likewise he, and at the front is the guy from the medieval blacksmith. Then we've got uh, this guy here who's just sending a message out using an owl, which I thought was kind of funny, almost, almost a bit like Harry Potter. <laughs> then we've got this knight over here who's just looking out, just, you know, on watch, checking there's nothing coming towards the castle that shouldn't be. Then, oh, I didn't mention this before, but we also have the, uh, portcullis. Now on to the main bit. First up in the castle we have these two stands. We have one which is like a fishmonger stand and then got a little bar one. And there's a little uh, barrel, got some glass and stuff. People are buying their drinks. Obviously those knights have got some drinks over there. In mugs I didn't <laughs> have many goblet pieces. Then on the other side for the other stands we have a little blacksmith stand with one serving people and then the guys repairing stuff. Got that sign just to attach that building. Then over here we've got this one which I love, like a little rotisserie chicken stand, which I thought was kind of funny. Got this little dwarven character with a little beard. It's got a bit of a quiff. He's a cool kind of <laughs> hipster guy. Then um, going on to the buildings now in this build. So the first building is this one. It's just a little house building. I think this, this is probably my second favourite. I do really like this one as well. I think this one came out really well. Uh, I'll show you the insides in a second, because I have to turn the boards around. Then we've got a little stables, got a little pony, and this little girl is giving the pony a carrot. Then we've got a little trough for this other, for the bigger horse. Out onto the other building, we have this one, which originally I was thinking to do like an inn or a pub, but instead it's the den for this character, who's a bounty hunter. And then she's the, well, kind of, I guess, kind of handler. She's the one that gives the payments to the bounty hunters. And then that's her little uh, gold hall upstairs, a little statue holding her sword and some armor. Again, there's just some more. If we can open it. Oh, now it's nice and it's not opening. <laughs> Either way, there's some more gold pieces in that chest. And then. Got a few other characters, got the wizard, again he's got a drink, he's had a busy day, so he's having a drink to end it. Got uh, some archers, pressing on a target, 
some knights on patrol. Got the Troubadour character from the new minifigure series. He's giving a performance and they've got all the people who are watching and be like, yay, loving this. And uh, then all there is to show is just the back of this building. Back of this building is the house of this knight. So he's got his helmet on the barrel, he's got a little uh, glass for his drink, he's got his sword on the table. And there's a fun little kind of story idea, I thought. So this guy is a knight, and that's his father's helmet, who was also a knight. I just thought it was kind of a little fun story thing. And then he's got a little bed, that's a bed I made for another castle build, but I didn't use it in the end, so kept it together. Just thought I'd chuck it in here and use it there. Got a little torch in the corner, it's got a chimney as well. I wanted to add a full chimney breast and everything going down the build, but I couldn't really get it to look as good as I wanted it to, so yeah. That just about wraps it up for this build. Um, oh, there we go. Um, I would love to know what you guys think. Um, let me know down below. So that's going to be it for this video. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you like these types of videos, these kind of walkthrough ones. If you want to see more, obviously let me know down below. And obviously comment down below, let me know what you think about this build. Because I really, really like this one. I hope people like it as much as I do. Um, yeah, I've got, there's going to be some more builds coming over this year. Well, actually, a lot more builds. I've got a lot of ideas. I just need to work out what I'm going to do, yeah, for these builds. But there should definitely be more builds and more videos coming this year. I think there's probably going to be some more army videos as well. I've got some ideas to do some other ones that I've got, other army factions that I can do. So those are coming as well. Um, yeah, that's it. That's all I can say. So, yep, like I said, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below like I said before. And that will be it for today. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.